How's it going, everyone? I'm Joshua. And I'm Sean. And today we are talking about science fiction. Uh, science fiction, of course, has uh, the, the most creative, definitely when it comes to lore. I've always, I, I love sci-fi. Yeah. I love it, man. Uh, everyone, they've got, people like fantasy and people like all these other different things. I'm sci-fi. Give me space. Give me aliens. Give me monsters. Like, let's just do it. I love it. I love it. So, uh, we're going to talk about some of our most memorables, uh, memorable monsters, aliens, uh, and just all kinds of crazy, awesome extraterrestrials. Uh, with us today is the, the Sultan of Monstrosity, <laughs> our good friend Lazaro. How's it going, Lazaro? It's going good. Awesome. So, um, we're going to do, uh, we're going to be good hosts and let the guests go first. Lazaro, what is your most... What what is your favorite monster in gaming that you can recall? Oh, I know this is such a new game and it just like came out like a week ago, but right now mine's the the Goliath from Evolve. Well, I'm such a small, scrawny guy, like No. Yeah. That's it. Yes. Man. Yes. And like whenever I see the Goliath and I take control of it, I feel empowered, just like super strong, like just I can overpower anybody that gets in my way. Right on. And so, like, just being given that ability, I guess that's what I like about him. It is a him. The race of girl. <laughs> <laughs> it's a boy, damn it! It's a girl. Like His physical appearance also looks really cool. Oh, man. He's, he's a monster. He's yeah. a monster. He's really cool. Yeah, he's, he's really a terrifying. beast. And I just love that roar that he does. And then when he evolves, that fire that comes out of his mouth. Mm -hmm. I, I will say, out of the, the three monsters that are in Evolve, the... Uh, this is going to turn into a damn discussion about Evolve. <laughs> anyway, out of the three monsters in Evolve, uh, the Goliath, the Wraith, and the Kraken, um, the Goliath is by far my favorite. It's just Same. super cool, man. And um, yeah, like you said, he he's a super awesome monster that, um, yeah, eat your heart out. Make you pee your pants. <laughs> yeah. Actually, they actually got the idea from combining Godzilla and King Kong. I can see that. I totally see that. Yeah. I totally see that. Okay. Sean, I think it's your turn. Mine isn't as much as a... You can associate it as like a monster, but really it's like, I guess, an alien life form. That's why we said monsters and aliens. And so um, I picked uh, The Flood from the Halo series. The Halo series. Yeah, Halo series. I don't know why I said Halo series a thousand times. But The Flood was always would always terrify me when I was like a little kid and everything when I first played it because it would like infest like the marine and everything and just like morph them and like it sounded super painful too as you could hear the marine still like like uh like screaming in pain and everything and i i feel like there's still like consciousness of the marine in there like mixed within the flood as well and so like he's still in existence in his brain but like the flood is controlling his body so he's kind of just trapped in his own body and he can't do anything that's how i kind of look at it i'm not sure if that's true but that's how i kind of look at how i've always looked at it as a kid and so like Every time I've seen, like, a, they always, they're really gross, too. They're not very pleasant to look at. I'd rather look at Goli the Goliath than look at the Flood. Like the thing. Yeah, the, oh, yeah, the thing, too. Oh, my gosh, the thing. But, like, <laughs> but, yeah. Uh, but, yeah, the Flood has always been, I guess, like, my, uh, it's always been an enemy that always stood out to me. Yeah, I, um, God, I hate the Flood. <laughs> I, I don't. Halo 3 for the win. I have no fond memories of the Flood. The The Flood is the one thing that I just... I hate the most about the Halo games. I love Halo, but I, I hate the Flood so much. <laughs> so much. They're so... Oh, the rem like the Halo uh, Master Chief Collection where they remastered it and then you actually see it talking. Oh, yeah. Yep. It looks so nasty. It looks yeah. so cool. It looks gross. Yep. Nope, I'm good. I'm good. <laughs> What's uh? What would be your favorite? Well, since I can't say the flood, um, let's see. Let's see. I thought I'd have something by the time we got to it. <laughs> <laughs> um. Hmm. I want to say zombies, but that seems generic. It's pretty generic. It is. They're terrifying and all, but. I, you know, I'm probably going to go with, I, 
I'm probably going to go, I think, with the... Um, I have a lot... Like, the, when I think of terrifying, I think of, like, the the uh, the infected from Last of Us. Like, I, I definitely... Like, those are up there for me, but okay. I I don't know that... They are terrifying. Like, clickers. that's... Yeah, the clickers are... Uh, yeah. Just super scary when I think of the you clickers. You mess up around and, them, you're dead. And all that stuff. But... Um, in the vein of not trying to say zombies, because I'm like my, I also think of like the witch and the jockey and all the crazy, the smoker and the hunter from Left 4 Dead. Yeah, I think of them too. Also, super terrifying, super frustrating, super terrifying. Yeah, but in the vein of trying to keep it uh, to somewhat original characters, um, I I loved, always loved, and loved to destroy. The Locust from the Gears of War games. Okay. Oh, well, that's, yeah. Um, uh, I, I'm a huge Gears of War fan. I, I think those games are just fantastic. Um, especially when it comes to third-person cover-based shooters. But, um, man, the Locusts were just, they were just big, they were nasty, and... Um, Pretty vicious. They're, yeah, and they were just, they, they just, they came in... in, in in packs, man. They just mm -hmm. never stopped. They were relentless in their attack to try to flood everything. Um, yeah, flood. I see what you did there. Um, but, it, yeah, they. it's just, I think everything about them, man, from the the giant spiders to the mm -hmm. berserkers, the berserker, man. Berserker, yeah. Uh, super terrifying. The Locust Queen was terrifying. Everything about the, the Locust and Gears games uh, was just, they're just powerful and, and monstrous and super crazy. Which is why it was uh, so satisfying to yeah. chainsaw one and a half. The, was... the Berserkers definitely didn't pop up in my head while I was thinking about it. But like now that you said it, it's not going to beat like the Flood yet. But when I was playing Gears of War, uh, which which one did they originate? Were they in all the first, It's in the first one. There, yeah. Whenever she, first, I think, actually. Or like... she. I'm sorry. Oh, uh, the Berserker, though. Whenever I like, first came upon a Berserker and I heard it like charging after me... That that literally scared. I got really scared. If if you don't know the the berserker, the berserkers are blind. Yeah. So they hear they hear only sound and uh, they follow movement, which makes getting around them fairly simple. Mm -hmm. um, but uh, man, all they do is just charge. Yeah. They just charge and destroy everything, and uh, and you can never take them down with normal bullets. You, you just <laughs> angered them. Yeah. So you had to like uh, in the first gears, you had to get them out into the open to where you could actually get to a signal where you could drop the, the hammer, hammer of dawn. dawn on them. Yeah. That was like the only way that. to beat them, and you're just like, oh god. <laughs> <laughs> but when you, yeah, it was just I'm definitely I'm gonna say locust, man. I, I love the locust from Gears of War. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna say locust. I couldn't agree with you. Okay. And that's going to do it for today. As always, if you enjoyed the video, please like, share, subscribe, all that stuff. Uh, what is your favorite monster or alien race from video games, man? Uh, let us know in the comments. Um, let us know why ours suck. Yeah, <laughs> let it, yeah, let us know what you think, man. And other than that, um, thank you. Thank you so much for watching. And uh, we will see you next time. See you later.